What's up everyone? Today is my mom's birthday, November 3rd. She was born in 1927. She would be 97 years old if she, if she lived that long. She died 39 years ago. Guys, it, it just, it doesn't even seem like it could possibly be 39 years ago. Um, I think about her every day. I mean, every day. But anyways, I am headed down to her grave. You guys remember last time I went down there and um, it was, I don't know, it was all messed up. The, the grass was trying to grow over top and I had you guys make me a list. <laughs> I got everything in the back of the car that I can think of that was on the list. I got the weed eater and the blower and the va little portable vacuum cleaner, the butcher knife. Um, oh my gosh. Another speed trap. Anyways, I got um, so much stuff in the back end. I'll try to remember to show you. Um, let me see if the speed trap's still here so I can push yes. Um, yep, it's right there. Dang, this road's got a lot of speed traps. I offset myself by getting off of 19 and because um, I was trying to find a target because I bought my mom and dad a silver Christmas tree. I remember having a silver Christmas tree when I was a kid. So I bought my mom and dad a silver Christmas tree. And then as I'm coming down here, I'm thinking, I don't know why I didn't get the white one for my, for my sister, Linda. You know, she died when she was a baby. They had a pink one when we got there. And I thought, no, I'll get the white one. So um, I stopped and got the white one. Henriette's sitting beside me. She decorated the white one for me. We got a silver one for Mama and Daddy's grave. And um, I got some blue flowers. And it's going to be like silver and blue. Silver and blue. Linda's is going to just be a white Christmas tree. Um, I meant to get a longer stick to make the tree go into, the, you know, to hold it in the ground more. But I will have to just see how this works out. Hopefully it doesn't blow away. Um, so I'm headed down to mom and daddy's grave for her birthday and, um, we're going to clean it up. We're going to really, we're going to really, really clean it up. So I will see you when we get down there. All right, everyone. We are at Serenity Gardens where mama's buried. Happy birthday, Mama. We are going to clean up her grave. We got her some flowers. And I got her a silver Christmas tree. It's right here. Henriette was putting the bells on it. I, I got silver because of my childhood. We had a silver tree at one time. I don't I don't have my seatbelt on. We pulled in the cemetery. I took it off. Um, I don't know who remembers. I guarantee you, some of you guys are going to remember um, having a silver Christmas tree that had this little thing that sat on the floor underneath that spun around with different color lights. Like there was no lights on the tree. It was just this light machine at the bottom that spun around and put lights up through the silver tree. Um, how many of you guys remember that? I know there's going to be a bunch of you that remember that. But um, Mama's grave is right out here to my left. But we are going to go down to the end and park in the shade and um, take you guys with us. Look at the flowers. Hi guys, I sent Henriette. She done passed Mama's grave. She doesn't even know where it is. I sent her up there to put the chairs down. I got my hands full. I don't know how I'm going to even focus on... Let me grab the blower. Alright, so the car is locked. I don't know what you guys are seeing. Yeah, she's going way too far. <laughs> I said, take these chairs up there and set them down. Let's see. Alright. Yeah, see, they don't... It doesn't look like they've done anything. I'm bouncing all over the place.
They're not taking very good care, care of the cemetery. Wonder what their excuse is. No way, mom and them ain't got nothing. All of my mama's flowers are gone. Somebody took them. Remember, it was the big fall flowers. It's right here, Henriette, and somebody took all of her flowers. And left that symbol in back there. Somebody took them. Can you believe that? They're just gone. I don't think Mama's grave. Hi, Mama. I don't think it has ever not had flowers. This thing here is all tore up. But her flowers are gone. She had some nice, nice fall flowers. I don't see. Yeah, I mean, they kind of look like those over there, but I'm sure that's not them. So, oh well, somebody took her flowers. I'd have to see the picture from last time. Hi, Mama and Daddy. Happy birthday, Mama. Today is November 3rd, guys. My mama would be 97 today. 97. I wish she could have just, you know, I wish she could have lived to be 97. My mom died when she was 58, guys, 39 years ago. Now, look, I did silver on this last time I was here. I want to do, I want to change it to gold. I want to do the flowers up, but we are going to, like, you can't even see the stone around it. Right here's the stone, but you can barely see it. So we are going to get to cleaning this up. We didn't bring the tripod. Um, so we're going to clean it up. I keep getting lightheaded. So we need the tripod and the vacuum cleaner. And I'll go ahead and start weed whacking. I'll set you guys up over here on the bench. Okay. I'll just unlock the door because I don't want you to lock the keys in the car. Because that's all we have. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. So, there's the grave. I'm just going to weed eat around it a little bit. Um, I did bring that vacuum so that we could really straighten it up. I'm disappointed in this cemetery. Because they are definitely not doing a very good job keeping this place up. <laughs> Yeah, that can go over that way, I guess. Yeah, I don't think. I think I'm going to need the hand shovel. We brought all kinds of stuff with us, guys. We brought so much stuff in the car. We even got an umbrella for around the grave. For while we're doing this. All right, guys, that tree must have went down at um, the hurricane. Now, Mama always said that tree was going to be big one day and she'd have a shade. Now, look, Mama, it's gone. They tore the damn thing down. So now we have no shade. I'm working on your tombstone. I'll get it done. Here, let's see if we got that in good enough, Henriette. We're trying to get the umbrella in so that we have some shade. Is it in good? I think so. Alright. Awesome. Alright, so we'll put the camera over this way. If it flies, it's going the other way anyways. Alright, guys. This is about what we got here. Oh, shit. Oh, that one's coming down. I'm like, why is that sinking in the ground? So I'm going to be here working for a while. So we might have to fast forward through this, but we'll see. Okay. I can do this and then dump it over there. Oh, shit. I just bought the 
this thing, so it better not see. I still need that little shovel so I can throw some of this dirt away. all the stuff in it. All right, guys. She's going to go get the other stuff because this does not seem to be... There's just too much dirt right now. Oh, yeah, that filter, that brand new filter is, like, destroyed now. Yeah, this is probably a bad idea with all this dirt. Damn. Damn. Just ruined my brand new vacuum cleaner, guys. Probably. Oh, shoot. She did not just ruin the broom. She did. She killed the broom instead of using the other end. Now we can't screw it back on here. What the hell? I got rubber gloves and everything. We'll just get down and do manual labor. Labor. Okay, Mama. Got y'all set up. I brought some styrofoam and everything this time. For the fly. Alright, guys. We had to get a lot more stuff out of the car. I brought a ton of stuff. Um, my hands are filthy already, and I brought rubber gloves. So, she went back up to the car to grab the other stuff. And we're going to get started on cleaning this up. So, let me put you guys right in here so that you're center on it. Hopefully, hopefully this is better. Alright guys, I'm just going to do what I can do with my hands. For now. I got the rubber gloves on like this right here this is supposed to be able to put the thing down in there I guess it doesn't matter because I don't ever want her vase flipped over but this is supposed to be where you can flip the vase over if there's no flowers here I would like to put rocks all the way around here I'm just gonna throw the dirt in a little a few spots That way it's not just piled in any one spot. I got you some rubber gloves too, Henriette. That doesn't belong there. I just dropped it. Can't just leave it. So many weeds in here, guys. Mom, 
Mama, I hope you're having a happy birthday in heaven. I hope you celebrate birthdays in heaven. Because I know I celebrate your birthday every year. And you're not even here. I definitely need some weed killer I forgot to bring. Oh, my back. It's killing my back, guys. All right, everyone. I dug around it as good as I could. Yeah, my back. Guys, I hurt my back this morning before I even left the house. And Henriette said she would come help me. But... She disappeared. All right, everyone, I sprayed some awesome on there. I'm gonna spray some more. I got my scrub brush with me. See what all it, what all it takes. I brought a bunch of gallons of water, but I might not need them. And I'm going to make it so sloppy wet that I might not be able to do the flowers if I, if I use that. So let's try this. Let's get in between the letters. Let's just try this. If I can dig out all the dirt from this, I might have to pour the water on it. I have a sprayer. I just hate to make it to where I can't paint the letters today. Who knows when I get back down here. It's so hard to get down here for some reason. You can definitely see all the dirt. Happy birthday, Mama. Clean this all up for your birthday. Oh. Daddy was a member of the Moose Club, and Mama was a member of the church. Yeah, I'm probably definitely going to have to get water, put water on here, just to make it look better. All right. I need, oh, I need, oh, I need my towel to sit on. Yeah, guys, you see how filthy it is. I got jugs of water, too, but like I said, if I... Oh, this isn't even twisted on right. If I do the jugs, this might not even work. Nope, I got the black one in the car. Maybe it'll work. This one's not working at all. Hmm. Well, shit fire. Guys, I dug deep enough around it, so hopefully this will. I should have just brought my jug over here because that did not spray. Boy, that looks good already. Huh? But I want to, I want to scrub it some more. I'm gonna need some more jugs out of the car. Guys, I got this spin mop here from TikTok. It wasn't much, it was cheap. But you can use it, you know, I use it in my showers, but you could use it at your graves. You can clearly see it's doing a good job. I wanna find out what kind of paint they use to paint the whole tombstone, and I wanna, I wanna paint the whole tombstone and make it nice again. I'm 
Well, this did a good job. All right, guys. We'll just wipe it down like this and make sure we get it all off. And then I'll just help it dry. I will help it dry. I might have to move the umbrella. I'm glad I dug that big hole around it. What do you guys think about that? Because now, there we go. I think it looks good. Okay. We'll let that, we didn't need to, but that's okay. We'll let that dry. That needs wiped out. Okay, napkins behind you. This can go too. Thank you. We'll just use some napkins and dry it off. It's probably gonna have to take a little bit more than napkins to dry it off, but um, I was gonna blow it off, but I don't want any. I don't want anything to um. I don't want anything to blow on it, so. Okay. I'm gonna need to, I'm gonna need, don't use that one because I'm gonna need to polish it later. Is there another little rag to polish with? We'll need the little rag to polish with. This is looking nice. Don't do this piece yet. Do that last. Because that's the dirtiest piece. Just gotta get this done first. Yeah, my rag's drenched. Now you can do the outside once the inside's done. I'm getting old. God, that looks pretty just from up here. It looks so nice and clean now. And I didn't even have to spend all that money on that expensive stuff, guys. I used some awesome. And that scrub brush really made a difference. Guys, I am still painting. I didn't realize the camera went off. Trying to get it done. I had some rubbing alcohol that got a couple of those spots off, but I think I need to bring acetone to get it off next time. I feel like it definitely needs a second coat, but I don't know if I'm going to do a second coat today. I feel like, oh, I feel like the sun's beating on me now. Holy cow. Where'd you go? You want to put my umbrella back up? So I don't get beat to death with the sun? Thank you. We brought more allergy stuff, right?
I'm over there trying to put the tree and stuff in there. I got the styrofoam cut and put inside that vase. Okay. So I got the tree. I don't know what you guys are seeing. It probably, I'm probably cut off, but that's okay. I got to twist the bottom off of the tree. And push this down in there so it's nice and strong. So for now on, the flowers won't blow away or anything. We're going to push this straight down the middle. Push it in as far as I can get it. Oh, oh goodness. Now we're just going to sort out the tree. I don't know which way it lays in there. I probably should put it back in there. I got another piece of styrofoam at the bottom. Let's um, see which way it sits in there. All right, let's put you back here so you can look down. Because remember, this thing only goes in a certain way. Oh. And you gotta twist it so that it stays. So this is the front of our tree now. So push it. Well, that might be where it's going to sit because um, I'll point the tree up this way some and then we'll put the, I'll show you guys the front half of the tree. Blue flowers right here behind. Oh, we got red and blue. So we got red and blue flowers. Look at the flowers, guys. I think I'm just gonna put them in behind the tree. I wish this thing would move now. Now I got it still oh, there it goes. Let me see. Oh come on. There we go. Maybe I needed to put it in like this way. And it's still gotta turn that way. Shoot. Okay, well that's okay. We'll put the flowers back over here. I'm going to have to bring you guys on this side. That's pretty. She's got their Christmas tree. Is the blower still here? No? We took it away? Okay. Or I can just wipe it off. Is the bottom of the broom here? Yeah. Alright guys. It's looking pretty. I don't even know if I want any red. I think the blue and silver, is this falling over again? Yes. I think the blue and silver look good. Hopefully that don't fall over. There we go. Yeah, it's looking pretty. Oh, I should have did it. I should have did a after picture before I put the flowers there, but that's okay. I'm gonna do it right now. That looks awesome, guys. Now I have some shiny stuff, but I gotta make sure all this other's dry first. Some of these other flowers we'll take to my sister's grave. I mean, we could put a little bit of red right here. And a little bit of red over here. We still have our Christmas tree in there. Oops, we just lost some of the red. At least I have a tag on this one. That thing is just flopping all around in there. So we still have our silver Christmas tree. Oh, it's pretty. I hope all this stays. Remember, the last bit is gone. Nobody better steal this. It's not, there's no way it's blowing out with that styrofoam I got in there. There's no way. So if anything comes up missing, somebody's taking it. It looks beautiful. 
I'm gonna bring you guys on this side so you can see. Mama, happy birthday. I gave you a Christmas tree for your birthday. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, guys, so we got our chairs. We're going to set our chairs up. Let me show you first what we got. It's pretty. We're going to set our chairs up and see what they think. Tell me what you guys think. Isn't it beautiful? Silver and gold, or silver and blue. I'll have a blue and silver Christmas without you. There it is. It's beautiful. All right, I'm going to set up and we are going to do maybe some spirit box. All right, guys, what do you think? Look how beautiful. Silver and blue and a little bit, a little touch of red. Happy birthday, Mama. Merry Christmas, too, because those are beautiful Christmas flowers. Seems like I don't get down here as much as I want to. But the tombstone looks great. It all looks great. All right. Did you shit? No. She shit herself. I did not. You did. I did not. Was it me? Was it me? Was it me? Was it me? Was not me. Was it you? No. She shit herself. No, I didn't. It wasn't me. No, I didn't. Hey, you know what? What? The first one to notice it dealt it. And you're the one that noticed it. So. I didn't do it. Yes, you did. All right, let's go to Mama's grave. <laughs>